Hey friends, I am at the mall. I'm at the mall so that you don't have to go to the mall. Today we are going to two stores. We're starting off here at Nordstrom and then we're hopping off over to Loft and we're gonna see what's in the store and we're gonna see if it's worth going in or if my theory is gonna be proven correct that there's way more options online. But regardless, I will link to everything below. So again, you could stay home and shop in your pajamas if you want to. Now, before I get into the stuff that is waiting for me in the dressing room, I thought I would flip the camera around and walk you through the outfit of the day, and then we can get into the trials. This outfit should look familiar. I've shared it all before, just not together. This blouse is from Avara, comes in quite a few solid colors, and I just love this blue, love the pleated collar, and then I paired it with one of the two pairs of white jeans that I also picked up from Avara. These have the distressing on the knees and on the back pockets, raw hem. And then because this is a try-on and I'm putting clothes on and off, I went with some slip-on wedges with clear straps. I loved this one so much. I grabbed it even though they don't even have it in my size because I wanted to share it with you. This is from Caslon and it is more of a tunic length as you can see. I have it on in a medium. I think the small would be better. It's meant to be oversized, but there's way too much fabric over here. I don't think the lighting here is showing this beautiful slate blue color. So I'm gonna try to pop in an image of it from the website, but it has really nice long placket of buttons. I'd say just below the chest level, two breast pockets, nice slits on the side, and it is a hoodie, which is just adds a fun, layer but let me get closer it is a waffle knit material and how i could see someone wearing this is unbutton it all the way down have this over a more fitted like white tank maybe some cut off denim, denim shorts or white skinny jeans it would be great over a swimsuit cooler evenings at the beach or by the pool i love this option and while it is Close to 90 degrees here in San Antonio, I'm well aware that many of you are still experiencing a true spring, and I think this would be fabulous. It does come in other colors, I think a solid navy or navy with white stripes, but I think this color is better for late spring. Moving into summer, you'll get more wear out of it. I adore this top, and let me tell you why. First of all, like all Castlon, runs huge. So I'm wearing an extra small. There are 34 Ds in here. There they are, plenty of room, and the armholes still cover up the bra, that is nice. So this is a gorgeous gauze material. This does come in other colors and some prints as well, but this pink is so, so pretty and perfect for spring and summer. So it is gauze, but it's not that thick, stiff gauze. It's very, as you can see, flowy and fluttery, lightweight. It does have a little tab there on the side. I would prefer like a front tuck or a full tuck. And then it does have the fluttery sleeves. So yes, it's sleeveless, but it gives you a little bit of coverage if you're worried about the arms. It's just a little extra there. And it is perfect, so cute with anything you can think of. Like I would definitely wear this with my linen castle and joggers, linen pants, white jeans, regular jeans, all the things. And this, while it feels a little more casual, I could definitely see wearing this with dressier pants. And because these are fluttery and soft, throwing a blazer over it, and you can wear it in an office setting too. So make this top. But I feel like I shared this in my last try-on video. It is um, a longer gauze top, and they've, I think, added sizing and colors. I'll untuck it in a minute, but I'm wearing it in an extra small because I wanted something a little more fitted with these slightly more voluminous pants. I love these linen pants. Linen, straight leg, they're not really wide leg. I love the subtle tone on tone stripe, makes my legs look way longer. They are pretty long. I mean, I'm wearing a pretty good size heel. Um, I wasn't able to check, but I'll put it on the screen when I edit this back. If these are available in petite, I would get the petite, so I'm five foot four. And I don't mind wearing heels, but I would like a little more, more options. Or of course they do have tailoring actually here at Nordstrom, but you could get something hemmed too, it wouldn't be the end of the world. But drawstring waist, I didn't tie it completely tight, but I'd say more true to size in these, wearing a size small. And then let me get you a closer look at this shirt. This is again, a gauze, lots of buttons, buttons in the pockets, buttons all the way down. And I didn't button it all the way because I knew I was tucking it in, but here's how it looks. Untucked, not buttoned. Definitely size down one because it's still 
pretty oversized. I would say that it fit a little tight in the arms at first, but in the two minutes I've had this on, it has loosened up. So if you want more of an oversized look, get your real size. If you want a more fitted, but still plenty of room, I would say stick with the size down. This is a linen tiered above the knee dress. I wouldn't call it a mini dress. It's just skimming my knees. It does have this really cool feature. So you could button it all the way up. I think you would choke though. It's, I think it's really meant to be worn open and it has a lot of material. I'm wearing it in the small, but it's kind of, I wouldn't say pulling across my back, but you, it, I can feel a little tightness across my back. I'm going to give you the good, the bad, and the ugly. Like, I'd rather you not waste your time buying something if it's not going to fit you right. So if you are broader in the shoulders or the back, this is not a good fit. If you run narrow shouldered, however, this is probably going to be your best friend. It does have pockets. I like the concept. I just, I don't know. It has really nice um, cuffed sleeves too at a really good length and it's flowy and cute. I think the extra small would be really tight across the back. There's no way I could fit into it. Now, if you're not, I mean, they're in there. <laughs> so if you don't have as much as I do up top, then sizing down might be an option. But speaking of options, I do have more for you. So let me try on something else. This one is one of these pieces, just stick with me here. We all have that dress, I, th I think we do, in our closet. It feels like wearing a nightgown. It's safe, it's comfortable, it's usually dark in color so that if you just need to throw something on really quickly, you don't have to worry about the bra and underwear matching or showing through or anything. That's this dress. So this is like the thinnest sweatshirt material. That's what it feels like. And it is so comfortable. It does have a subtle puff sleeve with elastic cu uh, cuffs. It is a drop waist, which I know is not everyone's favorite silhouette. I kind of like it. And then it does have pockets just above the drop waist. And I'm wearing it in a size small. I would not size down with this one either. I think it's more true to size. I don't know. It's It just feels like one of those things like after you've been outside all day working in the garden or you've been at the pool and you're hot, but you just need to throw something on. It has a nice crew neck. I really like this one. This is going on the short list. I didn't think I would like it, but. Okay, so hear me out on this one because this is such a departure from anything I thought I'd like. I would walk right past this dress, but there are quite a few women standing around the display just grabbing them. So I thought, all right, let's give this a go. So it is basically a new version of a shirt dress. Now it has the collar. There's no button here. It's just a nice, open v-neck kind of situation. There's some interesting pleating happening. Sort of a bracelet length sleeve, I'd say. The nice cuff that can be unbuttoned and rolled up. It does come in quite a few colors. You're gonna see it again in a minute. In a, uh, I'm wearing a small. I wanna see what the extra small looks like. It does have pockets. It feels delightful on the skin because it is that crisp cotton poplin. It is gonna wrinkle, I'm just warning you. The pleating is interesting. It has a high-low hem, very different. And I, I don't know why I love this, but I love this and I'm holding it like this because I think this would look great, obviously with a belt, which is why I'm reluctant to size down because I think the material, I, would, I don't know. But this, and this blue, again, the color is not doing, the lighting is not doing it justice. Dressing room lighting is not exactly the most flattering. Let's go try on the extra small just to compare how the two are different. Okay, I'm back in another color and another size. So this is the navy in an extra small and definitely size down. <laughs> this is definitely better. I didn't lose really any length. Still has all the nice features. It's just a lot less voluminous, but I don't love this color. I will buy this today from the store if they have it back on the rack in that gorgeous robin's eye blue. I mean, that was just such a stunner. I'm thinking how fun would that be at like barbecues, garden parties, pool parties, like any outdoor event where you're standing for most of it, because I'll admit this is that cotton poplin fabric. And so it will, I mean, you can see this one, maybe you can't see, pretty wrinkled. I know a lot of you have been asking for natural fabrics. I was showing you the gauze and the linen, and now this 100% cotton dress definitely ticks those boxes. And I do have also a lot of requests from people that are traveling to some really interesting places that need slightly more modest clothing, and this will tick that box as well. 
All right, we are done here. <laughs> Let's go on over to the loft, shall we? So if you're familiar with loft and their dressing rooms, you may be saying, Marnie, this is not loft. And I would say you are correct because they left our mall. <laughs> One of you actually messaged me and said, Marnie, there's no lot there anymore. So I found Athleta and boy, did I find Athleta. Let me share some of these finds with you. These are the retreat pants, I'm wearing them in a size four. I just bought these in the jogger version in this and white. And I'll share that, you know, what? I might add it to the haul when we get home. I'll show you what I got from there because I'd ordered those online during a sale. These are amazing. They have a nice zipper, drawstring waist, and I am five foot four, no shoes on. And there you go there. So I love these. I'm buying these like, spoiler alert, they're coming in with me. This is a really cool, it comes in other colors as well. Decently low, but not too low. There's no bra showing through. I think this is made of tinsel fabric and it's not see-through as you can see. So really pretty, really good basic to have, but I'm most excited about these pants. Okay, I think that those of you that prefer two pieces to a dress may love this. These are not usually the colors I gravitate towards, and I know they have more colors online, but these are two pieces. This is the skirt. This is in a small or a four. I can't remember how it's numbered, but it's that like dry wicking, water resistant, wrinkle resistant fabric. The pleating goes all the way around. A little bit of a high-low hem action, and then I've paired it with their scoop tank, which honestly, I'm in a small and see how it's gaping and being weird here. I think I need an extra small if I want it more form fitting. And these are both designed, I mean, you could technically work out in them. I'm thinking old school tennis outfit here, but this tank can definitely double as a workout tank. And I love the ribbing on it. I'll be honest, I think this color doesn't do a lot for me, but I really love the concept. And so I wanted y'all to see this because I love this big wide band. I think it's really flattering. I think it really hides the gut that is right here. It's a really cute option. Very fun. This dress is everything except the right size. <laughs> so they had it in everything but a small, which I'm pretty sure is my size. I have squeezed these things into an extra small. And let me tell you, one deep breath and it's all over. The bodice is all ribbing. It's beautiful. And then there's this little ribbed just under the bust sort of belt. And then same fabric as the Presidio dress, if you are familiar, and pockets, perfect length. Here's where the sizing is key. Let me see if I can get you to see it. It's really hard, but you can see there's a cutout here. So uh, back fat, it's definitely gonna be a problem when it's too small. However, I don't mind this cutout if it fit me because it's it's like almost nothing. There's actually really, of all the places you're gonna have back bet, it's gonna be higher or lower. It's not gonna be right there. And it doesn't go all the way around to the waist and show the love handles and stuff. So I am definitely gonna look for this online. Well, order it online because I love this dress. Also, it is the perfect travel dress. Like if you have to go to something straight off the plane, it's um, wrinkle resistant, it's water resistant, it's sweat resistant. You could wash it in the sink in your hotel room. It'll be dry in like an hour. Like this dress is just, you need this dress. You need this dress in your closet. I think it comes in other colors, but I think with the black, yours, this is gonna be your emergency dress for so many things. All right, I almost dislocated a shoulder getting out of that last dress. Not so with this one. This one is really cool as well. That same kind of athletic wear fabric but as you can see really drapey and fun more of a column dress wearing it in a small it does have pockets i'm gonna have to insert a photo of the back i cannot contort myself to show you the back is just thicker crisscross straps and i know you're gonna ask me marnie what bra do you wear with this one and i'm gonna tell you it's the same kind of bra that i would wear with the presidio because this is really just sort of athletic fabric also look at these really cool kind of sexy slits on both sides again with the pockets um i would wear a crisscross like a racer back type or cross back sports bra, really thin strap, because it's the same kind of fabric. So it goes, that's what I wear with the Presidio. I wear either like a really tight fitted athletic tank or a sports bra under that. So this will be so cool, like literal cool to wear when it gets super hot and it's got the pockets and it's that quick dry fabric. It's a really pretty color. The lighting is terrible in here, like possibly some of the worst. It has very high armholes almost a halter style. 
definitely coming home with me as well. I love this. Almost this as much as I love the Presidio. The armholes are a bit high. All right, this one is really fun. Now I'm wearing it in a size four regular. I don't know as a filming this if it comes in a petite, but I will say that at five foot four without the shoes, it spills onto the floor. This is the same material as the skirt, the pleated skirt, as the dress I just had on. That really, it's super thin. Now this has a nice color to it. It's a zipper. I mean, I don't want to get too, you know what? We're all grown women here. I've got a bra on. So it goes way. Okay, we're not going to go that far down, but it goes like below the belly button. So like if you wanted to make this really sexy, then you could throw a blazer over this and you can wear this to work. It does have almost like a band around the waist. And then it does have a little bit of pleating pockets. No pockets on the tush. It's really cute. I feel like of all the jumpsuits I've tried, this would be the easiest to get in and out of to go to the bathroom because it's fitted here. It's not just going to fall on the ground. Um, as you unzip yourself for those of you who are concerned about that but it does come in other colors i just love a black jumpsuit all right let's get home and see what i bought all righty i'm home so i have two bags of goodies to show you let's dive into it first we have nordstrom so what did i get this may be polarizing i can't wait to see the comments i think you're either gonna love this dress or hate it but i did go back to the dress area and they had this midi poplin shirt dress in an extra small, so I grabbed it. I have since looked at the links and the reviews, and it got really good reviews overall. Everyone pretty much said the same thing. It runs really big, and it's very effortless. If you are larger in the hips, this is fantastic. There's plenty of material. It also belts well, so I'm really excited to wear this. It's just a beautiful, very kind of different dress. And then the other thing that I picked up, I think I told you I was gonna grab it, and I realized that I buy something like this every year from Nordstrom, the flutter sleeve top. It also comes, I think, in a striped version and maybe a solid as well. I did stroll down to the Nordstrom Beauty Department before I wandered off to the rest of the mall, and you may notice a new lipstick color. I can't remember exactly what it's called, but it's the satin version. They have satin or matte. I got the satin and this is beige 103. I love it. And I also picked up the new, I think it's new, it's new to me, Super Goop Glow Screen SPF 40. It is so, so pretty. And the sun is coming out literally as I'm saying this. So I'm excited to give this a try. I will let you know. So do make sure you are following along on Instagram or you come back around for monthly favorites. I'll give you an update on that. And do go ahead and check the description box because I have everything linked in the order in which I tried it on. And if it comes in plus sizes or petite or longer or shorter inseam lengths, I've put all that information down there for you as well. So that was the Nordstrom haul. I did end up at Athleta instead of Loft. You can see how often I actually go into the mall. There was no Loft at my mall. They have left. I don't know what happened. And then I just walked by Athleta and this happened. Now this isn't all from one thing. So I thought I would share with you, Athleta had a sale recently and they carry some of my all time favorite linen joggers. So I went ahead and bought more of those. This is from a previous haul that I get to share. Um, these are the retreat linen pants, but they're the jogger style. And I got them in my usual size four over at Athleta and I got them in white. And I also got them in the chambray denim. But then the in-store part, I did go ahead and get the retreat. Now they say it's a wide leg pant. I say it's a little more slim. Now this one comes in a lot more colors than I realized, but I've said it before and I'll say it again. Going in store is just not what it used to be, whether it was Nordstrom or Athleta or a few of the other places I sort of wandered into. The in-store inventory is terrible, terrible. So I'm thinking for June, I'm gonna plan ahead and order online, bring it home, try it on, and then share it with you. Let me know if you're interested in that. So anyway, I did end up getting the Retreat wide leg pants and I just love their dresses. I love their dresses for summer. So this one, you remember this one, this purple dress, it has the crisscross straps in the back. This one also comes in quite a few other colors. It's this beautiful, bright lavender is not your thing. And like I mentioned in the dressing room part, I would wear this with 
a very thin strapped crisscross sports bra. Keep, and the one I have in mind are the ones from the Fruit of the Loom. They're just cotton, they come in all kinds of colors, and I'll actually link those down in the description box under this dress so you can find that link. I will say this about Athleta. I know it's a higher price point, but I also know they constantly offer sales up to 40% off. So follow me on Instagram stories. I will make sure I let you know when things are on sale. There is no reason to purchase these items full price. I will do it for you and review it so you do not have to. So anyway, I hope you had fun going on a virtual mall crawl with me and a little bit of a haul as well. I love making all that rhyme. Let me know if you had fun and let me know where I should order online from for the June dressing room try-in, which will be filmed in my house. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today. I hope that you had fun and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.